An officer opened fire after he says a driver was coming right at him head on. That officer still inside his patrol vehicle at the time, and thankfully, no one was hurt. West 2's Dave McDaniel live at the Ocoee Police Department with the latest. And Dave, police are still looking for that driver. They are looking for that driver. The description is, is somewhat vague. They're looking for either a gray or silver Infinity SUV. This all started a little after 10 o'clock this morning and a Coe police officer working to enforce the speed limit when things went a completely different direction. Uh, this vehicle or if anyone is injured as a result of this incident, to please give us a call. A Coe police were spotted looking for something or someone from Chopper 2 shortly after shots were fired on High Lake Drive and Doberman just outside of Coe City limits. A driver the officer was trying to stop for speeding, saying that driver was spotted at a high rate of speed, turned into the neighborhood, and there was an encounter. As the officer made his turn to go down one of the side streets, the vehicle was now coming at him head on. Uh, the officer discharged his firearm from inside of his vehicle. To your knowledge, no shots were fired from the silver vehicle. Correct to our knowledge. From the air, we could see the officer's marked patrol pickup being loaded onto a flatbed tow truck. It appears three shots went through the windshield from the officer's gun. We just know he discharged his weapon from inside of his vehicle towards that vehicle. I would be in fear too. Yes, I, I understand why the policeman did what he did. A woman who says she has lived in the area for some time came to check on her neighbors closest to those shots. I was like running out here to see, make sure no one got hurt because I've been here a long time and I didn't know if one of my neighbors had got injured or anything. The officer is fine and it does not appear anyone was hit. In an afternoon update, we were told they're looking for a gray colored Infinity SUV. And again, it's not clear whether or not any of the bullets fired actually hit that SUV. The officer is on paid administrative leave while the shooting is reviewed. Reporting live in Ocoee, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.